I feel like I should also. Eh, nah, never mind. That wouldn't work. I mean, it could, but it would just take up unnecessary fucking space. And I'll have to go back to like using. Uh, <laughs> niggas in general not like Shinra but I feel like if you're gonna be doing this right you should at the very least like record it you know like do your own broadcast thing you know take the t take the terrorist thing to like a whole new level you know what I'm saying so that way when shit like this happened they can be like nah that ain't the truth this is what we did and we got the fuck up out of there y'all saw the footage you know but whatever this is why I'm not a terrorist <laughs> Again, bitch? If I couldn't, believe me, you'd be the first to know. I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's, this is the actual real question. Yeah. Cloud! <laughs> okay, that was pretty cool. All right, come on. Chapter one on hard. All right, so if I complete it on hard, will they actually uh, give me MP and HP back, or what's up with that? Because <laughs> I still can't use my fucking idols. Looks like we made it, and with nothing but a few scratches to show. <laughs> Think you might have overdone it? I followed the instructions to the letter. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako. Well, let's hope the city's still in one piece. But the plan is what matters, right? I mean... I mean, this must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, I mean, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right, then. Lead the way. It did a thing. You got it. Huh. Watch out for live wires. They're everywhere. God, that Ugh. fucking cannon looks so good on fucking reeks. Barry. Can't wait to get out in the open. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Oh, it's me. Gotta do something about that. And soon. Fucking funky. I felt that one in my guts. They just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick me up. How much you know, further do we have to go? Not far. One of the things I can say I don't like about how they characterize that's like, about as good a place as any. Which stand back then, I'll set the bomb. It feels like can't wait to see you. Most of the time, can't it's a uh, oh he's fat, so he's always hungry type of thing. Or oh he's fat, he has to talk about food. Or oh he's fat, he has to complain about like not eating and, he's and good shit to like go. that. Which 
really makes me wish that we spend more time with them to like flush out the characters the more. Let that be a lesson because all we have is hungry, horny, and logically horny. And that's it. <laughs> that's their Attention, characterization. All Attention all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified intruders have detonated a bomb inside Mako Reactor 1. Multiple explosions have been confirmed, as well as ongoing fire. In response, a disaster warning has been issued in sectors 1 and 8. Structures in the area are at high risk of collapse, rendering the entire sector hazardous. Therefore, all residents of Hmm. No way. This couldn't have been us, could it? But what if it was? What's done is done. <laughs> Merc's right. It ain't pretty, but we can't stop now. This was just the first reactor, and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah, we always knew this was gonna get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. Oh, I need to go and do that. Your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your feelings. Whatever your problem, I got you. Huh. Hmm. I can get at like much later then. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, sure thing. Let's do that. Why am I still opening these boxes like I can actually fucking use items? Oh wait. Later then. Maybe. I'd like my money now. You can have it once we're back at base. You know what? I feel like Cloud should have choked his ass up right then and there. That is definitely artificial hardening. I don't need to tell you what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing material. You can have it for saving my life. Yeah. Just doing my job, nothing more. Yeah, yeah. I don't really that need it, Jesse. I'm lucky you were I there. appreciate it though, but I don't. I don't need it. We got enough of that, I think. Survival can be a matter of luck or skill, and you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. Uh, yeah. Well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? Damn, yo, talk your shit, Cloud. Okay, I was only trying to help. Oh, before I forget, here's a little something extra for being so brave. That really was the ride of a lifetime. Well, see you on the train. Why would you give me items and I can't use items? Yeah, that's, like, give me money at the very least. <laughs> Here comes another favorite part of mine. This shit, this shit is so fucking good. Oh my god, this part is so good.
Sephiroth is pretty much what you get when you're on Tinder and you swipe left instead of right and they pop back up again. You just can't fucking avoid this guy no matter what. They just keep popping up no matter how many times you swipe left. He couldn't be. But then... Alright. So... What makes this part so sick to me is that it takes you back to uh, like some of Nibelheim, right? But Sephiroth shows up a lot earlier in the story. The hell? Now, considering what they said about this game in particular and what the whispers actually are, I am more inclined to believe that Sephiroth and Aerith already know what the fuck is going on, right? So, Sephiroth, after Final Fantasy VII, pretty much tries to use Cloud as a means to him to stay alive. If that makes any sense, right? Because once you die, normally you kind of like dissipate into the fucking live stream and then you, you're reborn and shit like that. You may not be the same person, whatever, right? That type of thing happens. Um, Sephiroth is trying to defy that by using Cloud, right? Because Cloud and Sephiroth are linked together. You're not real. You're dead. I am. Uh, I killed you with my own. <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Painfully. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Were the planet to die, so many things would be lost. Your hometown burns so bright. The sound of her voice, pleading for me to spare you. The shiver of her flesh, yielding to cold steel. Yo, Sephiroth was kind of fucking twisted. <laughs> He definitely comes off like that more twisted in this game than before. Be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Yeah! Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. So, this is like the main reason why I feel that Sephiroth and Aerith knows like the entire timeline, right? And that this is not the same timeline I'm seeing things that we previously Fumes experienced Marco, maybe all right you got this now that's just a theory based on like what he says in this entire game like everything he says seems to hint at that ideal and he knows that he needs cloud to be alive in order for him to still exist whoever did this order has been issued the occupants of buildings in the vicinity of the so that's why it's kind of like yeah, good, Cloud. Yeah, hold on to that shit. Hold that L and run, nigga. Because I'm going to always be around. <laughs> and Sephiroth sound, I mean, says something like uh, pretty similar in like having children at the end. Where he says that he'll never be a memory. What a mess. And it's because of Cloud that he'll never be just a memory. Which is like, it's sick. Because as long as Cloud is alive, that means Sephiroth has the means to come back. But it doesn't mean to Sephiroth if that's the case. Because Sephiroth isn't the only one that has Genova genes, right? Zack has it. Uh, Aerith is an ancient. Um, Don't let the intruder escape. 
Can I just Security's everywhere. Can I just get the material though? So it, it feels like everyone can come back if they want it to. And Arif was already here. Like this is where we're supposed to meet her, right? But if this is where we're supposed to meet her, then why is she already there waiting for us? Because she knows. You are too weak to save anyone. <laughs> Not even yourself. Are you okay? And the whispers, the whispers are like are okay? the things that are trying to keep fate, like the timeline the same. But clearly Aerith and Sephiroth have Here, other plans. This is for you. Her? A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. I'm good. Oh, don't be like that. I know you want one. When was the last time you saw a real flower, huh? I just wanted to see like what dialogue she had. Plus, it'll make is. your girlfriend's day. Uh, I around. It. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case. <laughs> It's on the house. Enough already. I'll give you two gil for it. Two measly gil for a real flower? Come on. <laughs> Five then. Please, that's not nearly enough. Besides, I clearly said it was on the. <sighs> You're trying to get rid of me for five lousy gil. <laughs> Sorry, but your plan won't work. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. I need to go back and see if that's the line that she uses in the original. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. Because I don't so, recall that being a line that she uses before. So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self. <laughs> and this is Aerith trying to like overstay her welcome. Help me. And the whispers are like, nah, bro, you're supposed to be gone by now. <laughs> like, you're still not supposed to be here this long. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Like playing the game and actually knowing what the fuck these things are and their purpose and how Arab talks about them. It's just it's so much about this game that seems Drop your weapon. more than just a remake. And I think that's the reason why they didn't call this like Final Fantasy 7 blah blah, blah blah blah, right? Because we will have like a heads up on it. Already met me. Now I could be wrong about all this, and I just could be fucking right crazy, right? But that's not the impression that I'm getting. Was never in doubt. But yeah, I, I could be fucking crazy. I could be just talking out of my ass because that's what things seem like. But it wouldn't be the first time that uh, Square Enix has dabbled in some shit like this before. You know, with like time travel and things like that. 
wouldn't be the first fucking time. Oh nice, I got another deadly oh, die. Here it comes. Let's finish this. Doesn't tell me to do it. You're mine. There's nothing to it. Alright, now what was over here? I think it was like an item, right? Oh. Harvest guards. Well yeah, I could I could be fucking crazy, you know. Just give it up! Why you still actually hit? Let's finish this. I could have just let him rock and just fucking kill him off for a normal way, but whatever. We're here now. Really, guys? That's another thing that I, I kind of don't like about this game is how the game takes control of like your camera. Open fire, shoot the kill. At moments, and this is. Oh no, I'm personally not a fan of that. It's called personally, but whatever. Be advised, target approaching residential area. Seal all action immediately. Word. Target sighted. Get him. It's all or nothing now. Notice that beforehand. Is that it? I see him. Show you. <laughs> Not bad. It's like, did you really? Confirm. Target has entered residential area. Full of gun is in effect. All units. All right, next time I'm probably gonna fuck you. Oh, hey guys. Uh, I'll meet you on the other side. 